Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas 23. So my first clip today is really I just wanted to show you guys how my desk is coming along and like what I have in here. Um, this is probably going to change, but this is just how it is for now. Um, I have this really, really cute notepad that I got from my friend. And uh, yeah, I use this for lists of things I need to do throughout the day for ideas for YouTube, like what videos I want to do, grocery lists, etc. And this is the Ari pen that came with her lotion and perfume. I think that is super cute. I got this from Ross, just some fake roses with this like mirrored container, if you will. <laughs> this is a cat ring holder that I got from Destiny's sister. I do have rings in here, but I am currently wearing them, so. Um, and then I have my queen chihuahua that I got from Kroger's or Myers. I keep forgetting. I don't know why. Over here, I have an essential oil candle type deal that I got from one of my friends. And then I just have over here some uh, perfume. I have tons more perfume. But I just put like some of my favorites and the ones that I think are like so cute. Like I just can't stand it. This is Selena Gomez. Katy Perry, Katy Perry, Nicki Minaj, Ariana Grande, Britney Spears, and Britney Spears. And then I just have my purse right there chilling because we're about to leave. So, but in here, over here I just have, this is for my little essential oil thing, all this right here. No, I do not smoke cigarettes, so don't worry. <laughs> I just need the lighter for candles. Um, and then this is just some personal notes that I have for myself that I want to, like, film with, like... Just video ideas and whatnot and some bill stuff. These are two of my cat ears. I do have another one, but it's over by the side of my bed and I wish I would have put it here, but oh well. Um, this I got from my girlfriend's mom and this one is from the Katy Perry collection, which I got from Clears a couple years ago. And then I just have all my bows in here. Some are missing because they're scattered about, but... Yeah, so that's how it looks so far. I don't know. Like, I really am happy with this. Again, I'm going to be putting a mirror right here because I am creating a vanity, not really a desk. So, my outfit for today, I'm just wearing a purple shirt, some red ribbon earrings, a green comfy, like, sweater cardigan. I got the shirt and the sweater card cardigan from Target, earrings from Walmart, and my hair is just in my space buns, yay! Okay, so homelessness actually like runs in my family. I know people are gonna be like, oh, I can't run family, whatever, but both my parents have been homeless, my brother has been homeless, so homeless people really just, I don't know. I've had bad experiences with homeless strangers. I've also had good experiences, but there's this lady standing on the side of the road. Um, it's the 23rd, like it's the fucking holidays and she has a sign saying she's cold and she lives in her car and she wants gas and stuff. So Destiny and I went to Speedy. We put $25 on a fuel card and $25 on a food card. So here's $50 for her. And I just feel like it's hard to trust people. I'm going to say that right now. You never know who to trust. Um, if you guys ever feel like you want to give to the needy, do give cards. Or if someone says they're hungry, go buy them food, you know? So I told Destiny, well, why don't we just go and tell her, come with us and we'll... Wasn't she standing right there? Over there. We'll see um, I told Destiny, why don't we go fill up her car? And she's like, well, you never know. You can't really trust people. And I'm like, you know, that's right. And I don't want to think negatively or anything. I just really want to help this person. I feel like this is the best way we can do it. Um, just spread positivity. Keep it going. And I don't know. I just feel like it's really important, especially around the holidays. I'm like, say, do it every anytime you can if you can. But it's the freaking holidays, you know? Okay, so I wanted to show you guys, we were going to do like pre-made gingerbread houses where you just put them together, but we decided that we're going to make a bunch of cookies and decorate them. And this is like, there's how many of these? I don't know how many. Oh yeah, 18 cookie cutter what sets. The shapes on top? There's like a girl, a boy, a tree, a snowflake, a mitten, a sleigh, Santa hat, and stuff like that. And then we got a bunch of icings, you know, white, yellow 
pink, blue, purple, green, red. And then we got sprinkles. We got a Christmassy one and like a snowflakey one. Some more sprinkles. These ones are just bigger. And then a bunch of like icing decorations. Can you eat Roses. Them? Yeah, you can eat them all. Roses, bows, bears, um, stocking, stocking uh, gingerbread, Santa, snowman. I don't really know what these are, that but like peppermints. peppermints. Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. And these are my favorite, besides the roses. So yeah, that's what I think we're gonna do. We have to get the um the cookie dough, and then I think that's it. So oh, and I have to tell you guys what happened with the whole homeless person thing. That's a whole like story in itself. So you ready? Oh, and Destiny is also gonna get this eyeglass case chestnuts roasting on an open fire okay i can't sing okay so i have to pack we're gonna be going to destiny's mama's house tonight and tomorrow night we're taking twinkie with us of course and she doesn't live too far away so we're gonna come check on the animals like four times a day we have no problem doing that but we just want to like spend time with her family you know so i'm super excited for that and um yeah so i think we're gonna do the cookies tonight i'm not entirely sure but i think tomorrow for christmas eve i'm gonna wear these rose cat ears and then obviously for um christmas i'm gonna wear these because that's why destiny's mom got me these so they are broken but once you put them on your head you can't even like tell so they like fix themselves automatically. I hope I didn't just mess up my hair. Oh God, heaven forbid. But yeah, I'm gonna start a whole collection of cat ears. I am literally obsessed so much. So yeah, um, I think for Christmas day though, I think we're all just gonna wear pajamas. I think that's a thing now. I've actually never done that. I've always dressed up for Christmas because I always feel like I'm an overdresser. I'm never like an underdresser. I'm always overdressing, but, um, so I want to talk to you guys about a couple things. One of them is I want to say, I'm really sorry that, um, tomorrow and the next day, I'm probably not going to vlog a lot, but it's definitely going to be carried on in this video. Um, I don't want to fail at vlogmas. Vlogmas is filming every day. All the way until the 25th so I will be filming I'm not failing at this I have filmed every single day from December 1st to December 25th so I'm super excited in that I succeeded at vlogmas don't get me wrong we have had some ups and downs haven't we you guys this month has been eye-opening for me um a cat came into my life another one um no but this month has been eye-opening. I've made new decisions for myself. Um, things that I'm definitely going to talk about in the future with you guys. And I don't know. This month has been crazy. And things have happened this month that I never expected. I have been at my highest and I've been at my lowest. And I really want 2017 to be better. And I don't know. I think this is going to be the last video that I upload in 2016. And... Because I think I'm going to keep the rest of this month kind of just private and to myself. And yeah, so thank you guys for, a gr I'm going to start getting emotional. This is the year that my YouTube just blew up. Um, I've had very, I'm very back and forth. Um, it has been bittersweet, 110%. I have gotten more haters, but I've also gotten more lovers, and I've gotten more critiques, but I've also gotten more support, and I just want to say that I'm very thankful for you guys. Um, I'm thankful for the views and the love and sometimes even the tough love because I feel like a lot of the tough love has made me realize a lot of like things in my life that I need to change. and also the kind love if you will the soft love has made me not forget that you know I am a good person and like I'm glad that people can see that um it is unfortunate that 
I do have so much hate out there and I'm hoping 2017 can be different because this year has been crazy. I'm not going to say it's been like a horrible year, but it's definitely not been good. And, um, again, like I said, I've had some highs and I've had some lows and I just, I really want 2017 to be better, honestly. And I'm going to try my hardest to make it better. And I hope that I can do that. And I hope that my hate will lower and my love will higher. I don't really know if that'll happen, but it's something definitely that I need to try to tune into because I feel like if I spread more positivity and not so much negativity that I can change that because I didn't start YouTube to be known as a joke. <laughs> I'm not a joke. I am a real person and I feel like when I'm at my most vulnerable and when I'm literally me, like that's when I'm me the most. <laughs> I can't explain it. I am I don't even know. Um, but I am just so thankful for you guys. This year has been crazy and I don't feel like it's been a hundred percent for anyone. Um I heard that 2017 is supposed to be a great year for everybody, for people who believe in Zodiac and stuff like that. I'm not hundred percent a believer in that, but it is supposed to be a good year. Um I guess 2000, 2017 falls under a, something called a one year, which means I don't know. It's like this whole Scientology thing. I think that's the right word for it. Don't. I'm probably wrong, but it's supposed to mean it's going to be a really good year for everybody. So I'm hoping that stands true. And I hope you guys have an amazing year and the rest of the year. Duh. And I hope you guys had a great Christmas and hope you guys will have a great new year and all that. But now that I got that out of the way, because I just wanted to say that. I am grateful and thankful for you guys and I wanted to make sure I said that and I know this is going to be la my last video of 2016 and then 2017 I will start a whole new dwindle of things not new but I'm just hoping new year new me could be like a real thing <laughs> I don't mean to ramble so much but okay um I wanted to talk about the homeless girl so Destiny and I did do the two gift cards we did both for 25 and that was $50 out of pocket I did not mind doing that at all like come on um if I minded I wouldn't have done it but like I said when I saw her I got really emotional and it's cold out and I just felt really bad and um so we went we got the gift cards and we went to look for her and we couldn't find her anywhere I was so pissed off I was like did she just leave did she not get help but then I was like did she get help like that would be awesome if someone helped her before we did um but yeah, we did go back, we did try to find her, and we didn't. And I didn't feel right using those gift cards on us. I just didn't. So, what I did was, I waited at the gas station, and when I felt right about someone, I wanted to give it to them. I wanted to go up to them and just be like, you know, happy holidays, hi. Like, I know that's so weird, but I am a very giving person, so I did that. I went up to this woman. She was probably in her 50s, and I was like, hi, can I speak to you for a minute? I know it's so weird to go up to strangers, like, who am I? But I did it anyway. And um, she said, no, no thanks. And I know that she probably was thinking that I was asking for something, because that's usually what happens. People go up to you to ask for something. And um, I was like, I'm not trying to ask for anything. I actually wanted to give you something. And she's just like, no, like hella rude. And I felt so like sick to my stomach for some reason because it was just really rude. And I looked at her and I said, well, happy holidays anyway. And I walked away. Like it really upset me. You can ask Destiny. Um, right, baby? Yes. <laughs> yes, I was. I everybody. No, no, no. Yeah, it really just, I was very just like, I'm trying to spread, ho spread holiday cheer and it's not working. But anyway, so I waited probably 15 minutes until I felt right about someone else. I went up to this older guy. He was, again, probably in his 50s. And I said, hey, can I talk to you for a minute? And he's like, sure. He kind of looked confused. And I was just like, you know what? You know, there was this homeless girl. Like, I tried to explain it to him because he was giving me his ear and he was listening. And once I explained the whole situation to him, I was like, you know what, I want to give this, you know, away to someone else. And he's like, you know what? And I was like, 
what? He goes, you see that man over there? Like, across the parking lot, there was these... I don't, they're probably in their 20s. There was, like, seven of them just standing around. He's like, that's my son over there in the camo. Give them to him. And I was like, okay. So I went and gave it to him, and he took it. I said, happy holidays. He said, thank you. And I don't know. I just didn't... Neither of us, Destiny and I, neither. We didn't feel right using it on us because we did you know spend it for someone else who needed it I don't really know if these people needed it I mean everyone needs a hand here and there you know you can't go assuming but I feel like during the holidays it's like give to people who need it and give to people who don't and you never know they could have been traveling you need gas when you travel they could have and then one of the gift cards was just for food at that gas station they you need snacks when you're going <laughs> true true so I don't know I just I really love giving to people. I love seeing their reaction, even though that girl was... I was not expecting that at all. Because I was going by vibes, and my vibe radar was definitely wrong. So, this has been a long-ass clip. This, <laughs> But anyways, yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to pack. I don't know when I'm going to see you guys next. Obviously, either later tonight or it's going to be tomorrow. Um, the rest of this video will be of Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. And I love you guys so much. Mwah, mwah. On a nice Christmas Eve day, I am currently drinking Bailey's, which is an Irish cream alcohol. I have mainly ice in here because I fill the ice up and then... That's like the only way I can drink Bailey's and it's so good. And I just have a ton of Christmas movies playing. So far so good. I hope you guys are having a great day today. Hello. So, Destiny surprised me with this shirt, because I didn't bring any pajamas <laughs> for like when you open presents and stuff. So I'm about to go to sleep in these cute ass pajamas, wake up in them. <sighs> what? Twink! Where's Twink? <gasps> there she is. So, that's super sweet. So, what time is it? 12.48 AM, so technically it is Christmas, so Merry Christmas! Um, yeah, this is where we're sleeping at. <laughs> this is Destiny's brother's room, but he lives in Tennessee, so he actually is going to be here tomorrow. Bright eyed and bushy tails. Bright eyed and bushy tails. So, I just wanted to say hey, ho. Um, our Mammy and Pappy, I call them Mammy and Pappy too, just because I love them so much. Are those your brother's shoes? Where? No, those are curious. I was like, those look like girl shoes. <laughs> um, and we exchanged gifts, and oh, I left them downstairs. It was so sweet of them, and they loved everything we got them. I am just so happy that I was able to do that. Um, they seemed very like surprised and stuff, but I'm like, yo, you deserve it. Like, I love her mammy and pappy so much. But anyways, we're gonna watch some Shameless on Netflix and then go to bed. But whatever I film tomorrow will be a thing. Oh, he has us up here. That me though. That me. Okay. I will see you guys tomorrow. Merry Christmas. It's finally here. So right now it's 1.30 p.m. We didn't go to sleep until 3 a.m. And then we woke up at 6 a.m. To do gifts and stuff and then we were all so tired that we ended up falling back asleep and we all just about woke up in the last hour or so so yeah um oh yeah Destiny show them that oh so those were the ones that I was supposed to wear today the cat ears with the bells and they completely broke like I did nothing to make them break she so. just put them on her head yeah so that sucks but I am wearing these I did bring two sets of cat ears, but that makes me sad because Destiny's mom got me that. Um, but I hope you guys are having a great Christmas. Uh, today we're just going to have, you know, like family time and 
Destiny's mom is making tons of food. She started last night already, so that's exciting. Oh, and I have to show you the cookies. We did decorate tons of cookies yesterday. Oh my God, it was so fun. I have to keep reminding myself to show you guys. <laughs> but yeah, Merry Christmas, woo! I have had an amazing holiday and it's just been great. And I kind of wanted to end my vlog. Totally forgot to show you guys the cookies, so I'm sorry about that. But yeah, we decorated them and they look freaking awesome. But I just wanted to end this real quick because it is past midnight, so it's not even Christmas anymore. Um, but yeah, this is my last video of 2016. I'm thinking about filming of what I got for Christmas, but I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But one of the things I did get that I wanted to show you guys because I'm like literally shocked about it. Um, a Vera Bradley purse. Like, what? I have never in my life had a Vera Bradley before, so I'm super excited. Um, I, I can't wait to use it, really. And it's a lot bigger than the purse I'm currently using, which is right there. So, I'm excited to use that. But, yeah. Um, love you guys, and I will see you in 2017 if I don't do a What I Got for Christmas video. Bye.